Hello children. So today we are going to discuss the conversion of compound sentence and complex sentence. That is interchange of complex sentence and compound sentence and vice versa back complex sentence into compound and compound into complex. So this we are going to discuss. Right? So today's topic is conversion of compound and complex sentence so again how are you how are we going to study it we are going to study we will make two columns right this side we will start with compound sentence in this column we will write compound sentence and this in this column we will write complex sentence and we will change the compound sentence into complex sentence without changing their meaning Right, so this 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 is nice. This this is to be observed and this is to be understood that how when a complex sentence, compound sentence, is changed into complex sentence, they means complex compound sentence changes into complex sentence or complex sentence changes into compound sentence, but the meaning is does but the meaning does not change. This is interesting. This you need to this you need to see it and understand. So let us understand the first sentence. Let us and what is compound sentence? Yes, that I have discussed in my previous lectures. But again, let me because since the topic is before us, so we need to talk on this also. So compound sentence are those sentences where there are two clauses, two independent clauses, where there are two independent clauses, and both the independent clauses are connected by coordinating conjunction. That means for compound sentence, coordinating conjunction is a must. Without coordinating conjunction, compound sentence is not possible. What is compound sentence? Compound sentences are those sentences where there are two clauses, and both the clauses are connected by coordinating conjunction. What are complex sentences? Complex sentences are those sentences where there are two clauses. One is principal clause, independent clause. And the other is dependent clause or subordinate clause. Now, subordinate clause could be noun clause, adjective clause, adverb clause. Fine. So let us start with one example. Run fast, or you will miss the train. What is the sentence? The sentence is run fast, or 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 you will miss the train. So there are two independent clauses. Run fast is one clause which is independent, which makes complete meaning sense, and the other is you will miss the train. And or is what or is coordinating conjunction. We are going to convert this into complex sentences. Like unless you run fast, you will miss the train. You will miss the train. So sentence is this. Now into what is the sentence? Compound sentence is run fast or you will miss the train. In complex sentence, how have we changed? We have changed unless you run fast, you will miss the train. Here there are two clauses. You know, unless you run fast. This is subordinate clause. You will miss the train. This is principal clause. Now, unless you run fast in subordinate clause, in subordinate clause it is adverb clause of condition. Let us see another example. I am not well. I am not well, so I shall not come to office. See, the second sentence is. I am not well, so I shall not come to office. There are two clauses, independent clause. One is I am not well. The other clause is so I shall not come to office. These two are independent clauses, and they are connected by coordinating conjunction. Let us see how can we convert into complex sentence. I shall not come to office. 
I shall not come to office as I am not well. This is complex sentence. Now, if it is complex sentence, let us find out which is principal clause, which is subordinate clause. I shall not come to office. This is principal clause. As I am not well, this is subordinate clause. And subordinate clause it is adverb clause. And adverb clause it is adverb clause of reason. Let us find another example. She was ill, so I helped her. So, which is here? We have two clauses. It is compound sentence. That means it will have two clauses. Both the clauses will be independent, and they are acted by participle condition. So, she was ill. This is one clause. It is independent. I help her. It is another clause. It is also independent. And so is coordinating condition. We need to convert this into complex sentence. Let us see how can we convert it. I help her. I help her. I help her because she was ill. So this is complex sentence. So which is principal clause? Which is subordinate clause? I help her is principal clause because she was in a subordinate clause. In subordinate clause, it is adverb clause of reason. One more example: search, search the room, and you will find the key. This is compound sentence because they are two clauses of both the clauses are independent. Which is that such the room is one clause, independent clause. You will find the key. It is another independent clause, and and is what coordinating conjunction. How can we change this into complex sentence? We can change it into complex sentence. If you search the room. You will find the key. You will find the key. How have we changed into complex sentence? If we, if you search the room, you will find the key. So if you search the room is subordinate clause, and you will find the key is principal clause. In subordinate clause, it is subordinate clause of. Uh, in subordinate clause, it is adverb clause, and adverb clause it is adverb clause of reason. One final example. Let us see, uh, see in this order. In compound sentence, he is honest, and I know it. This is compound sentence. Why? Because there are two clauses, and both the clauses are independent. That is, he is honest is one independent clause. I know it. It is another independent clause. Both the clauses they make complete sense. That's why they are independent, and they are connected by coordinating condition. How can we change this into a complex sentence? I know that he is honest. Here it is complex sentence. Why? Because there are two clauses, and both the clauses one is dependent, the other is independent. Which is that dependent? Independent clause. I know is principal clause, independent clause. That he is honest is subordinate clause, and subordinate clause it is. Now, so here see children. Once again, I tell you what are we studying today, discussing today. We are discussing today conversion of compound sentence and complex sentence. That means we are going to convert compound sentence into complex sentence without changing the meaning. What is compound sentence? Compound sentences and compound sentences. There are two clauses, and both the clauses are independent, and they are connected by coordinating conjunction. So in all these examples, I have underlined both the clauses in each compound sentence, and they are both the clauses are independent, and I have inserted the coordinating conjunction because coordinating conjunction is must for compound sentence. Here. In complex sentence, complex sentence. What is the meaning? The meaning of complex sentence. The meaning of complex sentence is you know that uh, there are in complex sentence there are two clauses. One is principal clause, the other is subordinate clause. 
principal clause makes complete sense and subordinate clause depends on principal clause for its meaning and subordinate clause could be either noun clause adjective clause and adverb clause just one example i am just repeating it again for you so the sentence of compound sentence is run fast or you will miss the train here run fast is you know is coordinating it is a is independent clause you will miss the train is also independent clause because both the clauses makes complete sense by themselves and they are connected by coordinating position how it is changed in the complex sentence it is changed in the complex sentence unless you run fast you will miss the train here it is a sentence where there are two clauses one is independent clause the other is dependent clause so which is independent clause you will miss the train is independent clause which is dependent clause unless you run fast is dependent clause and dependent clause it is adverb clause and in adverb clause it is adverb clause of condition right so now next we will change complex sentence back into compound sentence fine so here we have seen what here we have seen compound sentence we have changed into complex sentence now we will do it otherwise we will change complex sentence back into we will say change complex sentence into compound sentence right the theme is same but we are doing it otherwise in other way let us let us take some examples of complex sentence and we will change it into compound sentence without changing their meaning the first example is i am certain i am certain that he has taken my book what is the sentence children it is a complex sentence that means it will have two clauses one is principal clause the other is subordinate clause so let us find which is principal clause i am certain is principal clause which is subordinate clause that he has taken my book is subordinate clause and subordinate clause it is noun clause that means we need to change this into compound sentence how can we change he has taken my book and of this i am certain see we have changed this into compound sentence compound sentence once again what is compound sentence compound sentence means the two clauses of equal rank both are independent and they are connected by coordinating conjunction so he has taken my book is one independent clause of this i am certain this is another independent clause and it is connected by coordinating conjunction let us see another example i am glad that he has recovered from illness this is complex sentence that means we need to find two clauses one independent clause the other is dependent clause so i am glad is independent clause that he has recovered from illness is uh, is dependent clause it is subordinate clause and in subordinate clause it is noun clause let us see how we have changed how can we change this into this he has recovered from illness and i am glad of it this is compound sentence why because there are two clauses one is two independent clause one is he has recovered from illness and that is i am glad of this of it this is positive conjunction let us take another example we can prove that the art is round we can prove that the art is round so which is that uh, principal clause we can prove principal clause which is subordinate clause that earth is round is subordinate clause in subordinate clause it is noun clause how can we change it 